got you balancing on my big red gum package. So me and old Junie, she's laying down here. Came out and hid in the truck. I was gonna film this inside, but Sweetie got up from her nap and the boys are loud and the puppy's insane today, so we came out to hide out in here. In my yeah, sugar girl, you love to track, huh? Um, so a couple things today. I was going to change the headlight bulb, but I can't find a five millimeter socket. You'd think with all the sockets we get around here, I could find one, but it's MIA at the moment. The kids, they just lug everything off. And then I was going to do um, the lens, the headlight lens restoration kit there from Turtle Wax. Never used that before, but uh, there's like this cream that you put on at the end after you buff them out. And it says it's going to cure for 24 hours. We're supposed to get rain this afternoon, so that one's out. It started out pretty today. It's all beautiful and clear, and now it's pretty cold and overcast. Actually, I got laundry on the line. What time is it? Okay, so I've got about an hour for it, supposedly anyway, have about an hour before it rains. So, I'll have to go get the wash off the line here, pretty quick. Just one of those days. <clears throat> then, earlier today, while Sweetie was taking her nap, the uh, puppy was barking in the kitchen and going nuts. So, I put her out, so she wouldn't wake the baby up. And, when I come outside, I had an empty bear bait pail in the back of my truck. You probably know where this is going already. So I come out and there's scratches all over my tailgate and up the both sides. On both sides of the back of the truck. <sighs> I'm telling you. Hopefully they'll buff out, but I'm not impressed. I get that it's not going to stay real nice for, you know ever obviously but dude come on the town hasn't even cashed the check yet for the registration give me a break not happy so hopefully we can buff that out just one of them days you know where like it's just one stupid thing after another makes you want to just go hide in a cabin in the woods all by yourself, you know? Oh my gosh. So, we're going to try to make the best of it anyway. We're going to clean up the house and make some applesauce this afternoon. Right? <laughs> Is that right? You happy dog? Yeah. Happy dog. You silly. So yeah, still reclaim the early evening hours. Also another like thing that's been driving me bonkers lately, if any of you guys are like techie, you know, you know a lot about electronics and stuff. Maybe you can help me out. I've got a Movo shotgun mic on my Canon M50 camera. And I think the cord that goes from the mic to the camera is bad. Because if I pick this camera up and try to pan with it or anything, I get tons of like crackling and artifact in the background. So much so that I can't even use some of the clips that I have because it's that bad. All you gotta do is just pick it up. And it does that. So I've ordered two different cords. And neither one of them was the right cord to fix that problem. I was hoping not to buy a whole another mic. But if I have to keep, you know, buying cords that don't work. Might as well just buy a new mic. But I was trying to avoid that. So if any of you guys 
know what I need to fix that. That'd be great if you could drop it down in the comments down below. If you got like a link or just the name of the cord or whatever. I don't even know what I'm looking for, honestly. It's just a Movo shotgun mic. I don't know. Well, puppy's got a chicken. Hang on. Hey! You leave that chicken alone. Ain't too bad. No. No, 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 no. 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 Ow. You're going to spill my tea. Get out. Okay. Thank you, baby. Psycho dog. Well, that was just a little tidbit on what's going on at the moment. So, Lord willing, we'll go in and make our applesauce. Have a nice evening. Check the bear bait. And see what uh, tomorrow brings. Alright guys, uh, take care. Thanks for watching, and we'll catch you on the next one. Um, um.